Hey everyone, this is Michael again and welcome to another movie review. And today's movie that I'm going to review is Jack Reacher Never Go Back. And it stars Tom Cruise, Kobe Smulders, uh, Danica Yarosh, Patrick Husinger, and Robert Nepper. And this is uh, the, the sequel to the first film, Jack Reacher, which came out in 2012. Uh, this film was directed by Edward Zwick. Uh, Tom Cruise produced the film. And, uh, you know, I saw the movie today, watched it today online. And I thought it was, for a sequel, I thought it was okay. Uh, wasn't as good as the first movie. Uh, I really enjoyed uh, the first movie uh, when it came out, Sword in Theaters. And I really enjoyed it. Uh, the first film, Jack Reacher, it's a good movie and it's a very enjoyable film. Uh, but this film, uh, it's basically about, the film is basically about Tom Cruise, uh, who reprised his role as Jack Reacher. He goes back to his old military headquarters and he comes in contact with Major Susan Turner, played by Kobe Smulders. And she gets framed for treason, you know, like a crime that she didn't commit. And both of them are on the run by uh, the government, this rogue government. And they are also on the run from uh, this assassin who is hired by, uh, who, who is also hired by the rogue government, who is played by uh, Patrick Hersinger. And, you know, so they're on the run from them. And then you got this other uh, side plot to uh, the film where it deals with this girl named Samantha Dayton, played by uh, Danica Yarosh, who, if you don't know her, uh, she played uh, Milena on Heroes Reborn. Uh, if you all ever watched it, you know. But and then she was also on a popular uh, Showtime show, uh, Shameless, which is still running, which I never even watched. And, you know, her plot has to deal with, you know, maybe she could be, you know, uh, Tom Cruise's character, Jack Reach's daughter. Uh, so that's basically the whole plot to the film. Uh, the story for the film is all over the place. It has problems. Uh, but, you know, the film does have its problems. But uh, I thought Tom Cruise did a good job. Uh, reprising his role as Jack Reacher, very enjoyable. Uh, also liked uh, Kobe Smulders as uh, Susan Turner. Uh, think uh, both of them, in my opinion, uh, do really good in the film. Uh, uh, Danica Yarosh uh, was uh, sort of enjo was enjoyable as uh, Samantha, but uh, you know the whole like I said, the whole story to the movie was all over the place. It, has uh, its issues and pro and problems, uh, but uh, the action to the film in the film uh, was uh, okay. It was it was just there, but you know, Jack Reacher uh, never go back. Uh, like I said, it's an okay uh, sequel, but not as good as the first movie. Uh, but Robert, uh, got to mention Robert Nepper is there. Uh, you know he has a, uh, you know some screen time, but you no, know, just not through the whole film though. But he does have his screen time. Uh, he plays uh, General uh, James Harkness in the film. Uh, but, you know, like I said, Jack Reacher never go back. It's an okay sequel. Uh, not, it's not a great film by any means not perfect or great but uh film is not as good as the first movie so i think uh it's this film is kind of is kind of missing uh you know some things that i really liked about the first film it just didn't have that same you know sort of uh magic that the first film did uh it was just missing something though in my opinion though but, uh, yeah, so if you've seen the first Jack Reacher film, you know, you, you could give this movie a watch. 
you know, I'm not going to highly, highly recommend it. I'm just going to uh, recommend, I'm just going to, you know, throw it out to you all. Uh, if you want to watch the film, if you've seen the first movie. So, but yeah, so like I said, uh, Jack Reacher, never go back. Okay, see, okay sequel. Uh, not great or perfect, but not as good as the first movie in my opinion, though. So, anyways, that's it for my review of Jack Reacher, Never Go Back. Uh, thank you all for watching, and until the next video, I'll see you all later.